Hey guys, I'm recording a little video in relation to calories to give you a better understanding of what works really, really well. So before what I used to do was I give you your calorie uh, intake for the day and uh, let you go with it. Okay. Now I'm, I'm thinking something that might work a little bit better for you people who like to have a drink at the weekend, like a takeaway, like to go out at the weekend. This might suit you a little bit better. So rather than tracking your calories, you know, on a daily basis, uh, we add it up. So say your calories is, say I put you in a calorie deficit and it was at 2000. This is just for argument's sake, it's easier for maths. So 2000 calories per day is what you take in if you were in a deficit, uh, which is 14,000 calories for the week. Okay, now, Instead of doing what we used to do, I'm going to tell you to start tracking on a Friday. So start tracking your, your calories on a Friday. So that when you have a Friday, Saturday and Sunday where you might go out, you might have a few drinks, you might have a takeaway, whatever it might be. Um, and let's say you went really wild and for the three days you had 9,000 calories, right? So 9,000, so that's for the three days. That means you're only left with 5,000 calories for the other four days. So this is for the Monday to Thursday. And this one is from Friday to Sunday. So if you went mental at the weekend, you had all that drink, you had all that food, you had 9,000 calories, that's a lot of calories, but if that can happen, it can very easily happen that you have 9,000 calories over a weekend. You've only got 5,000 calories now for the next four days, and that breaks down to 1,250 per day, okay? 1,250 per day is all you've left. So instead of having 2,000 calories every day, and then going wild at the weekend and going over your calorie amount for the week. Now we have the 9,000 calories at the, at the weekend, but now we're only having 1,250 during the week. Because a lot of times what I've found is that people are saying to me, oh, Monday to Friday, I'm really, really good, but Saturday and Sunday, it's out the window. So this method allows you to have a weekend where you can go and drink and eat and whatever, but make sure you track it. Then come Monday to Thursday or Monday to Friday, whatever way you want to do it, you have to reduce your calories down in order to stay in a main in a deficit and lose weight. Calorie deficit equals weight loss. You cannot lose weight unless you're in a calorie deficit and it has to be over a period of time in order to see any benefits. So this is great for the weekend warriors, the people that like to go mad at the weekends, Let's start tracking on a Friday and see how that works out for you over the next couple of months.